Hey guys, Angel here, and now the moment we've been waiting for, the official Paw Patrol the movie trailer is released today. It's on Instagram under Paw Patrol and Paw Patrol the movies, and doing a face reaction on you on YouTube from Paramount Pictures. Before I begin. The footage and audio used in the Angel Eye Storm does not own nor created and use it for review, commentary, and education under fair use. Please support the p creators and the companies by watching the Paw by watching Paw Patrol the movie on in theaters or in Paramount Plus in August twentieth. Rated G. This con this trailer is created and rightfully owned by Vicom, Nickelodeon, Paramount Pictures. Spin Master, the director Carl Cal Bunker, along with along with the many talented performers like Adam Levine, animators, design artists, composers, writers, script artists, storyboard artists, etc., etc., etc. Now let's begin. Try moving this along. Real quickly. Oh my gosh. That trailer was fantastic. Oh my gosh. The detailing, the designs on the pups, and Chase's uniform. Oh my gosh. Everything is more detailed than the TV show. Like, especially Chase's uniform. And I think like the only criticism I got is the character design for Mr. Porter and Farmer Yumi. I like the ones in the TV show a little bit more. Mercury looks, Mercury looks not that bad. It's just that I want, I wish her nose was from the uh, TV show a little bit better. But Ryder, Ryder and Katie, absolutely love the designs. They're perfect. That's all I gotta say, they're perfect. And so is the puffs. The puffs designs are absolutely perfect. And they make Rocky so fluffy. I love fluffy puppies. And I just love how like the pups, like before the trailer begins, the pups came up to the screen. Look at this, oh, this is so is adorable. <laughs> Everything is absolutely fantastic. I love the character design. I love the pups' new uniforms. And I'm so excited that we're finally gonna see like how the pups gear up because like, you know, they gear up after the swipe of their Paw Patrol pup badge. You know, you go up, badge swipe, continue going up, and then all the routine. But we're finally gonna see like how the pups gear up. I'm so excited. And I really like the inside of the lookout. It looks so very well detailed. If that tower ever existed, if the lookout tower becomes like real life, I want the inside interior to look exactly like in the film. And so would the Avenger Avenger City um lookout tower. Rappel's angelic voice. That was perfect timing. I think that's my gonna be like one of the funny bits. Also, Sky's new um gear, the wedgie drone. Oh my I'm surprised that Sky will be the one who did this. That's my girl! I'm so proud. <laughs> I'm just kidding. But I, I didn't know that Sky has a wedgie drone. Well, I'm not sure what he's I'm like, I'm like, I'm like, really? <laughs> the person Sky got a bit of sass in her. And I love it. I also love Liberty. She's like, I got this. Get out of the way! Move! You gotta know how to talk to people. I'm like, that's true. That's true. I mean, like, I grant you, writer, let me, Ryder is more of an Adventure Bay kid than an Adventure City kid. And poor Ryder. Like, he was about to say, Power Joe's on the Are you kidding me? And like, welcome to the city. Welcome to the city, Ryder. The one thing about the city life is the traffic jam. Ugh, it's the worst. I mean, like, traffic jams are terrible, especially if they're in the mornings or during a storm. And believe it or not, the water machine, I believe, must be belonged to Mayor Humdinger. 
And the re and now we know how the monorail got derailed is because Mir Hamdi was the one who built the rail for the monorail and one of the rail tracks got broken. And something must have happened to the truck that skid and like skid like skid across. I think I don't know how, but I think it could be either like something was in the middle of the road or there was like co driving complications that caused the driver to go like the front of the truck over the Avenger Bay Bridge. But I'm so I can't believe like the driver's being so like like a dog. I just like how Chase calmly like like he says, actually sir, I'm a puppy. And Brian and the driver's like, that's even worse. I'm like, dude. A dog is like a puppy is like a baby dog. So, and Chase is like, I just like how Chase doesn't take too much offense to that. He's like, you're in shock, so I'm not going to take that personally. I'm like, that a boy. I can't, Chase is such a good boy. I love this. Like, it's so amazing. I'm so excited to see this film. I think, like, there's going to be some major climax, especially the part where you see, like, Chase's upset, angry face. And he took in, like, the leap of fate. Look at this. Chase's upset and angry face. He's on top of the building, which is the same place where he learned his motorcycle. I think something, I think that's the same place where Ryder is stuck inside, you know, Clive grumbling, hooking up the elevator shaft, but it's going to start to collapse. That's one major conflict. That's one, like, climax conflict. Number two is Sky, you know, Ejecting from her helicopter and solving the big explosion. That's number two. That's pretty big. But the biggest one is Chase. Upset and angry without his police cap. With pe pieces of the debris broken. And he's no. taking that leap of faith. Too small. And it wasn't slow. Oh. And the rain. I mean, it's such a climatic and dramatic moment. That you can see like raindrops stopped. Like I think something will cause. I think Chase sees or n notice something is wrong. Most likely Ryder. So he's taking that leap of fate to probably save him. And oh my gosh. I think like the Paw Patrol movie is going to have like pretty big like you know emotions. Climax. Problems. Situations. Even more so than, like, you know, the Paw Patrol TV movies and the show itself. But anyway, I can't wait to see it. This trailer is 10 out of 10, and oh my gosh, I'm so excited. I really want to know more. It's just too bad that we had to wait, like, two more months until it comes out. But on the plus side, at least, we got the trailer. Huh? Hopefully there might be the Cal Cal Bunker will make some more trailers. You know, each each of them different. Like you know, maybe like a trailer could be like about getting know the pups. Like you know, the team like Ryder, Chase, Sky, Marshall, Rubble, Zuma, Rocky, Liberty. I mean, it would be kind of cool to see like like how Rubble became part of the Paw Patrol. Like. In the same design as the uh, Paw Patrol um, movie. It's just too bad that Everest and Tracker won't be in it. Because I really want to see what they look like. I personally hope that Cal Bunker and Paramount Pictures decide to make like a second Paw Patrol, the movie theatrical. Maybe this time adding all the pups and Wildcat. Like, I want to see Everest. Tracker, Tuck and Ella, Rex, and Wildcats designs com combined with the 3D animation. This is super amazing. But then again, like animation takes time. It takes, you know, love, drafting. Believe me, I will actually watch a segment, a segment of this in P Disney Plus under Pixar Inside. I mean, Paramount Pictures is one of the animation studios, along with Pixar, my personal favorite. Like, 
Paramount and Pixar are the only two ones that I know. That I know, like, growing up. Well, actually, there's more. There's Paramount, Pixar, DreamWorks, um, Sony Animation. Um, there's Universal Pictures, Warner Brothers Animation, well, Disney Animations, and those are the seven animation studios that I know and I'm very much familiar with. And plus, it'll take them, like, probably, like, a year. I mean, like, like, the Hotel Transvo Transvo Transylvania Ford Transformania. I mean, it took them, like... I thought like Hotel Transylvania 3 would be the final movie, but and it aired back in 2018. And it probably took it took like three years just to get the fourth film done. And as for Space Jam 2, I don't know. I think like because like it was 25 years ago. I think it was announced last year. Or it was in the work in progress the year before that, and then eventually they decided to, you know, tell everybody that some the big news about Space Jam coming back. Either way, I hope you guys enjoyed this, and um, I hope you're excited about the film as I am. Tune in next time for more Frost Testing videos. Angel Einstein sing, Paw Patrol is on a roll. Peace.